I'm Natalia Bonner. It is day 95. Today I'm stitching with the Inside Out Machine Quilting Ruler. You can pick this ruler up and the batting, notions, all those yummy things that I'm using here over on our website, peaceandquilt.com. I do also want to remind you though, our brand new book, my brand new book, I should say, um, Visual Guide to Creative Straight Line Quilting is now available for purchase. So in this book, I've got more than 60 designs that I walk you step-by-step -step through the machine quilting process. There's borders, there's sashings, there's background fillers, plus a lot of block designs that you won't find in this stitch along. So do make sure you check that out. Signed copies are available on my website, peaceandquilt.com. Before we do actually get over to the quilt though, I do want to let you know that I'm using one layer of the Quilter's Dream Poly Deluxe batting on this particular panel. Wait, what panel am I using? So if you're just joining me, the panel that I'm using is a fun panel that I designed that goes along with this stitch along. There's links below where you can pick up your own panel and stitch along with me if you'd like to. However, the panel is not necessary. You can totally stitch on just solid fabrics, fabrics from your stash, anything that you want. But make sure you are stitching along, sharing your progress, using our hashtag, and you'll be entered to win weekly prizes on Instagram if you do all those things. But in the meantime, let's get stitching. You can see here that I did go through and mark out this design before I began any machine quilting. This isn't necessarily something that I do on every design, but with this one I thought it was beneficial to actually mark out the entire design before I started quilting. So I started out by marking a straight line right through the center of the triangle. Then from there I measured in two inches and marked two diagonal lines that are parallel to the outside of the block. And then I marked a third line, or fourth, whatever it is, um, across the bottom, a point-to-point -point curve using the largest curve on the inside out machine quilting ruler. When I begin stitching, I'll start stitching in one of the bottom corners and I'm going to stitch along that marked line or using the curve point-to-point -point stitching from one bottom corner to the other bottom corner on the triangle. Once I reach the right-hand side of the block, I'm going to stitch straight lines that are vertical right through that bottom curved section. All of these lines are going to be a half an inch apart, so I'm going to use just the markings on the Inside Out Machine Quilting Ruler to stitch those lines, stitching up to my previous stitch line, and then back down to the bottom ditch, filling in that curved section. Once I filled that in completely, then I will travel along my previous stitch line up to that marked two inch diagonal line. I'll stitch along that diagonal marked line creating an inside triangle. Once I've stitched out that inside triangle, I'm going to fill in the inside of the triangle with some fun, tiny matchstick quilting. You'll see here as I'm stitching it out, I'm using the side of my ruler as a guide to help my lines stay nice and straight. I'm not adjusting spacing or anything like that. It's just a guide to help keep my lines straight. And I'm not perfect. My quilting is not perfect. My spacing isn't always perfect when I do matchstick quilting, but overall it looks pretty good and that's good enough for me. After I've completed the design, I'll stitch in the ditch all the way around the outside and then spritz away those marked lines. Hey friends, I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow. Thank you.